Hello, welcome to the Click Experts. And today we're going to talk about the best ways to use prompts in Chat GPT Part One. Uh, these are going to be quick videos, uh, just so uh, we can uh, just get everybody started on Chat GPT, just using it. And um, it's a uh, it's different ways you can put prompts in to get uh, a better understanding of how Chat GPT works. Now, there are a couple of books that are out there right now. There's one book right now that I'm kind of reading over right now. It's called The Chat GPT Millionaire uh, by Neil Dagger. And he's got some things in here that are some pretty good ideas. Uh, and one statement says that instead of asking for how to build a website that calculates compound interest, you would ask it something like, let's put that in here right now. Instead of asking that, we'd put, please give me code for an index.html page with a compound interest calculator. And there you go. It writes the code for you for, now, if you're not a coder, you probably wouldn't use something like this anyways. This is probably more for the coders, uh, but it can uh, bring this in here. It'll write the code uh, to be able to build a calculator uh, that calculates compound interest, but it's the way that you ask. So let's stop that because uh, it's just an example. Another thing we would want to talk about is kind of ways to approach chat GPT with your prompts. Like, uh, say we want to, let's say, write, let's see here, write a paper about, uh, let's say, let's write a paper about, um, Let's say Hulk Hogan uh, in a witty, funny, engaging tone. So, and there you go. The man, the myth, uh, the mustache. See, it, 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 you can play around with this. And I think the best way to do this is just to get in here and play around with it. So, and it's writing a witty, funny paper about Hulk Hogan. So let's, uh, let's try another one. Let's go. Uh, uh, and this is another example in the book. It says, uh, say, write a podcast introduction. Uh, let's see here. Write a podcast in introduction on bears in the style of Joe Rogan. And there you go. Look at that. So it, we have this AI has the information to do this for you. And you know it's a uh, it's a it's a good tool as long as you know how to get to maximize what you're using it for. Uh, now there are another there are other prompts uh, we're going to talk about in prompt one that go act as. Now you can these are things where it's it gets interesting. You can act as something, and um, I guess we'll jump right into it. We'll say act as a screen writer you will write a screen play that is let's say fiction and fantasy this screen play uh, needs to take 
place in let's say London, England. The screen play should be full of drama with a plot twist at the end. Okay, let's fix that typo. And let's see what we get. Uh, the Hidden Kingdom opening shot. Oh, see? Panoramic view of London skyline. That's, oh, look at that. See, there's so many things you can do with this. And uh, remember to always check the work when you're looking for certain things like facts, even though this is not facts, this is more creativity. Um, and this product is pretty creative. It's pretty creative. I don't think it's completely competing with a very creative mind of a very creative human being, but it's pretty close. And it's very good for people who aren't creative like me. So, um, it, and it writes it out right there. So let's stop that. That's pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. So let's look at another one. Let's look at, uh, let's look at something that's more of a blog type thing. So we'll say, please write. No, no, let's do this. Let's say, please generate five engaging titles for a blog about red wine versus white wines. So let's look at this. Oh, see? Now we come up with some topics for blogs. Um, white wine, which is Oh, white wine versus uh, red wine versus white wine. Which wine reigns supreme? The great debate, red wines versus white wines. And if you don't like the responses, we can say regenerate generate another response. Give me something different. You can hit that button. So that's that's pretty cool. And we'll stop that. And the next thing we can do is actually have it write a blog for us. So let's say, let's do, please write a no, we can have it actually write. Oh yeah, please write a a movie movie review. Yeah, let's do that movie review for a blog post on read one read two. Read, read. Let's say blog post. Say comparing Let's do that. Write a blog, write a movie review for a blog post comparing read one, read two, and let's just make sure this is correct. And read three. Okay. If you are a fan of Rocky franchise, okay, you're in for a treat, Creed series, three films under the belt. And there you go. It establishes itself as a modern day classic, sports drama genre, and uh, this film, uh, Don's Creed, Son. Okay, so it writes a blog for us, and this can write a blog very quickly. Now, you want to make sure to check these things too. Don't just automatically assume that it's right do your editing there may be mistakes in there this is the this is probably the the beginning stages this is the beta stages of the release so you have to make sure you check everything and um basically you can uh we're, we're just going to stop right here on that uh, i'm going to make a, a prompt uh, video two for this but i want these to be short and so you can just play around with these but uh, that's it for right now, and we'll be back for, with the next video. Thanks for watching. Also, thank you to all those who subscribe and donate. You make it possible for us to continue creating great videos for everyone. See you again soon.